guys, we are back once again. As you can see, still have the three walls up there. World's loading, so it's uh, being a little bit laggy, but I think we explored the uh, that entire last area. Um, I am going to go along the rail to the area after that. However, I'm not going to ride a minecart. I'm going to run on the rail and check in and see if Vex booby trapped that one too. And hopefully I get a railway repair kit at some point because, uh, yeah, a lot of running involved. Not all that fun. Well, for you anyway, I really don't care either way, but uh, it wastes your time. So, yeah, which is also why I want to make sure that none of the other ones explode. My inventory is a bit of a mess here, and it's getting to be nighttime. What I think I'm going to do is I'm going to get to the uh, next area. Why is there experience just sitting here? That is strange. But uh, I'm going to get to the next area. What I'm going to do is I'm going to drop down a bed and sleep through the first night that comes up, so my spawn point is over there. And I'm going to get shot in the face. Uh, but anyhow, drop bed and sleep there, so that way, if I do die... What the heck? How did I never see this? Damn it, I don't have any bones. I know I had that same issue last time. But I don't recall seeing this. X is hiding buildings from me. Or maybe I'm just not opening my eyeballs. Hopefully this one isn't filled with blazes, huh? Now, I, I'm using a different um, output on my computer, so hopefully... Uh, and I had to adjust it because the headset I'm using is a little bit screwy. So, hopefully this doesn't cause any kind of weird lopsided volume issues for you guys. So... But, uh, yeah. Appears to be just another one of these... I don't know how to label it. Apartment complex? Oh, yeah. Okay, I've got everything, but my head is about to break. I pick that axe back up. Do not want... That axe is nice, though. Probably won't use it too much, but it's still nice. Melon, arrows. I'll put those two arrows back in there, just because I don't want to have yet another stack of arrows. Hopefully I can find some uh, more torches or more coal in one of these chests. Hopefully. Somehow I doubt that. Hmm. There's not even a chest in this room. Once again, I'm not checking all these, but I don't know if he's really too worried about filling in all of those. At least not in these things. These places seem more like copy and paste with some random chests added. Yep, more arrows. Fine. Fine. I'll take them, and I'll go get the ones out of the other chest. Uh, wood. I'm pretty good on wood at the moment. Still gotta check these. Don't know why. I stopped checking the furnaces, though, because I haven't seen anything in them for a while, but... Like I said, I think these places might just be copy and pasted with nothing in them. You know, other than a few randomized chests, which he probably hand-placed or something. Well, of course he had to have hand-placed them, but I'm pretty sure he has just this whole thing as a template. Because they all look pretty much identical. You know what? I've got enough arrows. And I know I was going to get those other arrows that I didn't. But, what are you going to do? Yeah, I wanted to look behind me there for a second, because I wasn't sure if I was slowly approaching anything. That's a very planted sapling. I'm gonna need a new bow if I keep this up, but if I keep killing spiders, 
that's not going to be a problem. But I would kill for an enchanting table. Hmm. You skeleton, over there. Provide me with your bones. Or don't provide me with your bones, jeez. That could have been very bad. If that wolf would have walked in front of me while I was sitting here sw swinging, I could have very well hit him and got murdered. Put that back. I really want you doggies, but I haven't managed to get any bones recently. If I really, really wanted bones, I could go back to one of those houses, find the spawner, isolate it, and repeatedly kill skeletons. Which should also give me experience, but it would also be very boring. There's a bone. I don't want to just do it with just one. So I'm going to look for at least one more for good measure. But I don't want to wait too long, because dogs can despawn. And that is something I do not want. Okay, I've got two bones. Let's go see if we can't get one of these dogs with these bones. My luck, I'm going to go back there and they'll be despawned already. I don't want that dog to the right, because he seemed to have been following me. Come on. Come on. That was some strange pathing. Why? Why does it break dirt in one hit? Stand up. How about you? Eh, I figured as much. But I got one! What to name him? That is a very good question. I'm going to name him... Ted. Yep. Ted. He is now Ted the Wolf. He's also staring at me. It's very creepy. What's that building? That can't be the building I was just in. So many things that I missed. Well, there's a victory monument. Definitely not going to have an issue getting uh, string. Because I did have like, what was it, like 30 something that I got rid of before. <clears throat> I apologize for that. Peg! Peg! There's a skeleton over there. Give me bone. Actually, I don't even care. My throat is just, like really dry at the moment. Excuse me a second. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, I'm sorry for that. I. Yeah. I don't know. There's a lot of buildings over here. Creepers. Creepers. No! Okay, he's alive. He's alive. Oh, fuck, I'm done. Wow. Oh god, and there was a ghast over there too? Okay, I can be almost assured that everything I just had is completely lost. Considering that was pretty much everything I had that's going to make this very difficult. I will punch you to death, spider. And unfortunately, that also means that my wolf is dead. But I do know that it was just over from the Mc Vic Victory Monument? Victory Monument. And it's probably really foolish to be running out here with nothing. But uh, I didn't make a base, so... Nothing is going to be how I'm rolling. Yep. I may actually have to start up a farm and stuff, but I'm trying to avoid that. I'm going to go check for my stuff real quick. And... Wow. I can only assume it is gone. 
Wow. Look at the size of that hole. Oh, even wow, just just wow. That's all I'm gonna say to that. There's a skillington down there. Okay, I'm gonna run around the side and even see if the door I went in is still there. No. No, that door is gone. Along with everything I was carrying, for that matter. That's a bit of a pity. Yeah, I don't see anything. I see some wood, but I'm pretty sure that's from the building. And I don't see any chests in here offhand. Well, that axe lasted real long, didn't it? Along with that diamond armor. Well, the diamond armor actually did last kind of long. I'll take this. Thank you very much. Hmm. Well, I hope there wasn't anything important in that building because it is gone. Now, I don't have a whole lot left, and I don't want that. I do want to see if there's anything up there, but I now have no food, no tools, no weapon, and I'm resorted to punching a spider to death. And because I've decided on uh, keeping these episodes around 20 minutes, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do each of these recording sessions in one hour segments. So every three episodes will have been recorded before I upload, uh, minus the first two, because I had only recorded, I think it was 45 minutes on that one. Um, so if you have anything to say, well, I'm guessing there's not too many people that have actually played the hard version yet. I'm not sure. I didn't even know about it because it wasn't whenever you put out the original map, it wasn't out there. So, I, I don't really know if it's necessarily hard, but there's a lot of exploding. But, uh, let's see what I can get going here. I do know that there's a lot of stone down there. Which, there's a little bits of stone and whatnot up here, too. What is that? Oh, cobblestone. Perfect. Kind of looked at gra looked like gravel at first, so. But I am going to dig up six pieces at first. Make a better pick. I need to basically get re-get all of my tools again, but I'm not too concerned to be honest. I'm back to no armor, which is always fun. I'm not playing on hard, so it's not like entirely life-threatening to have no armor. I am kind of disappointed that my dog is dead. Ted, you were short-lived, and you will probably be forgotten. Not being an ass, just being honest. Of course, though, a lot of people consider my honesty to be very assholic because I tell them exactly what I'm thinking. So, whatever. Uh, oh, shit. I'm gonna have to... Well, looks like I'm gonna have to cook up charcoal. What was I making? No. No, I'm not making a shovel out of wood. But I'm going to have to make charcoal because I need torches. So, I guess I'm going to have to make use of this. I know this is all of a sudden going to be very, very, very boring footage. It's kind of like starting Minecraft, but in like the quickest possible way. So I apologize. And I have no food, so doing this over here is a very bad idea. But, I don't really have much of a choice. I'm gonna have to go find that chest that has all the buckets in it. And it's actually a really good thing that I dropped off those bones. I think they're at, the, at a chest at the, uh, what was it called? Castle Creek, I think it was called. Um, 
I left a bunch of bones over there, so I'll be able to make a wheat farm without water. I am going to collect up the rest of this cobble because I'm going to need a building material. I'm going to need to make more torches. Torches? Tools in the future. So, yeah, I'm trying to keep the commentary going, but I know I'm going to end up repeating myself a lot. Like I do. I should just shut up, edit this part out, but people don't like edits. That, that actually kind of looks right. I was trying to determine whether or not that was the right amount. I'm going to let that cook through. I'll probably pick up some more coal, but I need to get to those bones before... Well, I'm not necessarily going to starve to death, but I think I'll get reduced to uh, half a heart if my food bar is empty. So, I'm going to have to go get those bones and quickly wheat. Just quickly wheat. I don't really want to fight anything without a full food bar, so... That's not what I meant to do. There. And that. Now... Yeah, I guess there's not a whole lot that I really, really want at this very second. Except for maybe a nice sword. But, uh... Yeah. If you're wondering why I took that record, I like that record. That is my favorite record. So, three more, I'll just, oh, uh, anyhow, throw this wooden pick in this hole, do not want, that should be enough to cook that, take those back, I'm going to make torches, And now it's time to head out. I'll leave that furnace here. There's not a whole lot left of that building. I wanted to see if there's anything left up on top of it, but from the looks of it, there isn't really a top left of it, so... Ooh. Oh, fuck my life. Stay far away from the blazes. They already caught a tree on fire. <sighs> okay, this is going to be slightly more dangerous than I had previously intended. Partly because I don't have arrows anymore. I don't have any food, but I have seeds. I'll be able to make a hoe easily, and... I have bones that I left at the other place, so I'm going to have to go get those now. And with any luck, I'll come back. The wolves will still be here. I'll be able to tame those. They'll get slaughtered very quickly, but they will make for a decent meat shield. At, you know, at least after the initial attack or meat getting attacked. And sprinting is not going to make my food problems any better. But, I need to get there as quickly as possible. Just a, just a real question. What is the point of making a map if you're just going to blow it apart? I really should go down there and see what I can't get a hold of. I need to remember which of those buildings those buckets were in, but I think it was the supermart. Or supermarket, or... It's the Quickie Mart. Hello, and thank you for coming to the Quickie Mart. Oh, may I help you? Uh, well, I can't sprint anymore. The station, I see it. It is now within my view. Wait a second here. If that's the s okay, yeah, I was in that building. It's another one of those... Uh, Apartment complex? I don't know, whatever you want to call it. I'm glad that I managed to successfully not die to, uh, or die with wool on me. So that's always good. But I probably just jinxed it now, so... 
My desk is made of wood. I will knock on it. Oh, I just knocked on my mouse pad. Which is still technically sitting on wood, so close enough. Yep. That's what I have to say about it. Close enough. Bones. Hooray for bones. Seeds. 